Defending champions Hella Wigman have again reaffirmed their title defence after putting away an equally star-studded Vipers outfit in a hard-fought win 18-14 to record their fifth straight win since round five. As expected, it was a showdown of two of the heavyweights of the National Rugby League competition with both teams fielding their best 17 men for the brutal encounter that kept their fans on the edge of their seats. After weathering the storm in the first 10 minutes of the opening half, Wigman's general Solomon Pukari, displaying his strong leadership and direction through the middle, saw right winger Siki Content dived over for the opening try of the match on the 11th minute for a four points lead. Vipers would look for an immediate response, and they did just that. This time it was nippy number seven, Nicky Hustle, to weave a bit of his own magic when he caught the Wigman's defense off guard to level the score for all. As if that was not enough, Vipers were over again, this time with the number six, Malik's winners, sticking his nose over the line to put Vipers further in front, 10 4. Wigman were able to regroup quickly at the back of some good roll on through the middle. A quick shift to the left found young try scoring freak Cyril Saber, who easily beat the Vipers' defense to the line for a 10 all half time score. A penalty kick from Pukari after the break put Wigman in front by two points before former Wigman Gilmore Paul crashed over on the left corner to push Vipers back in front 14 12 on the 65th minute. The pace and physicality of the game continued into the final 10 minutes until Saba silenced the Vipers crowd with the match winner. At full time, the final score Wigman 18, Vipers 14. Really improved from last weekend. Now it's everything, it's, it's everything is week in, week out, so we have to improve from previous games to be a competitive player. And what else? Uh, yeah, not the result we wanted, but uh, I'm happy with the efforts of the boys, small things that cost us the game. We, we, we have still have next week to go, so we'll work on it and come back stronger next time. Harry Longwood, TV One Sports.